How's it going guys? Jocks here with another video and today I have an interesting topic about making the decision to join the tech industry. Now I know I've had a couple of videos about this topic before but this one's a little bit different because it's geared to a specific group of people. So making the decision to get into the tech industry can be, you know, both daunting and exciting at the same time. Um, but it's easy to get lost between the different pathways you can take between being self-taught, going to college or doing a boot camp. A company reached out to me to talk about an opportunity that I think might be perfect for some of you. So personally, I've noticed that there are three scenarios that crop up when it comes to figuring out which pathway you want to take to become a developer. They'll either go to college, join a boot camp, or be self-taught. So a number of factors kind of play into this decision, but it typically boils down to two of them, time and money. So first I wanna talk about the money factor. College degrees and boot camps both cost money. Um, there are a couple free ones out there, but the ones that are really serious about giving you the structure that I've seen um, and the ones that are more popular typically cost a pretty penny. According to educationdata.org, the typical cost of a four-year degree totals around $175,000 when you take into consideration housing and out-of-state tuition, or $100,000 if you attend in-state. Meanwhile, according to coursereport.com, the average coding bootcamp costs just under $14,000. But despite the large range in costs, both choices sometimes are still outside the realm of affordability for people who don't have the economic standing or opportunity to afford them. Self-learning is an option, however, that pathway doesn't always provide the same level of structure and guidance that comes with your boot camp or other certified institution. From my experience and those shared with me, money plays an important factor when deciding which route you want to take in your coding journey. Another important consideration is how long their pathway that you choose will take to complete. The typical bachelor's program takes around four years. And lastly, the self-learning pathway, according to Career Camera, takes anywhere from six months to a year. So what option is there for somebody who desires the structured learning process that comes with a coding boot camp or college institution, but they can't afford either? Well, the sponsor of this video has created their own solution that really fits this scenario. I'm happy to introduce App Academy, the boot camp that released their entire full stack coding course for free. App Academy ranked number one for best coding bootcamp in 2020, according to switchup.com. They have a unique tuition repayment program that delays all payments until you secure a job if you decide to take their full-time course. But for those of you who still don't see that as a viable option, they went even further. They created App Academy Open, which is a free version of their full stack coding bootcamp course. App Academy Open has over 1500 hours of reading material, videos, and projects for you to take that cover Ruby on Rails, JavaScript, and a ton of other skills to help you learn how to code. Combine that with an interactive coding environment and a community chat feature, and you have an enormous open library of learning material that is literally structured like a boot camp, but it costs the same as learning yourself. Check out the link in the description below if you want to get some more information on App Academy Open and what it could offer you. Anyways, thank you guys for watching. I just wanted to take this opportunity to share some new information that was provided to me that relates to that specific niche of people who want to have the structure and that process that comes with a college degree or a boot camp, but can't necessarily afford it. I think App Academy Open is pretty cool. I mean, this video is sponsored, but I took the time beforehand to look for myself to see if this is something that I feel like would be relatable and applicable to those people. And obviously would be content that is worth checking out. Uh, and I can say that the course that they actually provide, while it can be a little difficult, does provide you everything laid out. It's going to take a little bit of work for you to actually get through the entire course and a little bit of research on your own time to be able to kind of bridge the gaps that would typically be filled by an in-person instructor like you would get if you had paid for their full-time boot camp. But for what it's worth, it is a very complete and comprehensive library of, uh, of all the materials that will make you a very competitive full stack developer. But anyways, I hope to catch you guys in the next video. Thank you guys so much for watching. See you next time.